angry guy here and only fans creators are using children to sell their subscriptions now guys if you have a topic you want me to discuss to request a topic for a video see the description below also turn on the notification bell so that you'll receive notifications or whatever i put out a new video now let's just go ahead and jump into this video because it is quite i would use the word deplorable Mr. Beast made the wrong person famous because this girl started making weird videos with her brother to promote explicit content. How does it feel to have a sister that has an OF? My friends always ask me if it's pink, but I don't really know what they mean by that. Do you, do you know? Jesus Christ. Click the link in my bio. Just, I can't. Chief. I literally don't understand why people are so pressed because he enjoys making these videos with me. It's literally out of the kindness of his own heart. He enjoys it. He has fun. I even get to take him to do some really cool stuff. So I really don't think he's upset about it. Are you? <laughs> no, not really. Oh my goodness. Guys, this is so sad. It's pathetic. This woman's about 21 years old now. She was roughly 19 when she was in the Squid Game video. She, after that, you know, she started making her own videos on YouTube. She was not extremely successful with that. She's literally said in the video, like someone asked her, because uh, I, I actually remember, she seemed interesting. So I, I actually followed her before she started doing this stuff. And someone literally asked her, like, you know, where, you know, where's your OnlyFans? And she goes, I don't have an OnlyFans and only fools, and I will never have an OnlyFools. And, you know, fast forward just a short time later, and she has an OnlyFools, and she's using her brother and her family members, her father, her mother, her family members in her videos, right, to to sell her sell her subscriptions on OnlyFools, and then she has videos flaunting all her cash, and it's like absolutely sad. I mean, talk about destroying your future, and then you bring your family into it, and like you, I mean, you have your kid brother here, and it's like. It's like, what kind of world do we live in right now? No decency, nothing whatsoever. And it's like, young man, do you know what your sister, like, obviously you know what she's doing and you're there getting a cut of this. And if it's like this entire family's like, well, it's, it is what it is. I mean, it's, I think she's, I forget, she's Hispanic, but it's like so miserable. It is so miserable. I think maybe Brazilian so miserable what she's doing in, in, in Western society and what Western society has come down to where this type of thing is now seen as viable. You have all these young women who are liter who are on, you have all these young women who are on YouTube now, basically trying to teach other women how to do it and how to get successful on this horrible platform, lonely fans or only fools. And it's like they think that this is a future. They are literally selling their future for instant gratification in the present. And it just won't stop. And when I see this, when I see videos like this of, of these women who are now using their family members and they're like her little brother. She's using her little brother. Okay. Cat's not even 18 yet. And she's using her little brother to sell her subscriptions and talking about Jesus. Jesus does not have any part of this, sweetie. All right. Jesus does not want any part of this. Like, oh my gosh. And the simp economy, the simp economy is just too tempting for these women. And let me tell y'all right now, AI is, is, is closing in. AI is closing in. And then, and over the next 10 years, it's going to steal, it's going to take a big piece of, a big part of that money away from these women. Okay. It's going to take a big part of them, of the, of the money away from these women. All right. Cause you have a lot of these chat bots that are popping up where you could talk to your, talk to a girlfriend, you know, have a chat, a, 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 an AI girlfriend and she'll send you pictures and you can, you know, you can, what's the term? Wife her up. I mean, come on, bro. It's, it's getting crazy out there. It's getting crazy out there. And these girls, they think that this is going to last forever. They can do this forever. They're going to, they're wasting all of this money. All right. They don't have financial planners or any of that or accountants. Listen, these women, they don't know how to manage money. So you're going to have, so they're going to get desperate. They're going to get absolutely desperate because they're burning through all this cash. And they're not going to find, they're not going to be able to find themselves a good man. You know, they're not going to be able to build a family. These things are gone. They don't care, though. It's it's basically like Myron said from Fresh, like, you know, at Fit. They're just, they just want to get their bag. They just want to get their bag. They don't care about anything else in the world other than getting their bag. And they will do anything and everything to get their bag. 
And I'm just, I'm, I'm being honest when I say that, like, I, it's like part of me really does not care at this point. But when I see that they're using their actual family members, like, bro, you're using your little brother and she wants to flaunt about it. She wants to flex about it. Like, yeah, I could do whatever I want. I could do whatever I want. You know, Moist Critical, he did a video about her like maybe a few months ago. And I was like, dude, all you've done is made her more famous. Like, congratulations, bro. Congratulations. Congratulations. All Because now all the simps on your channel are going to flood her Insta and her, her YouTube, her Insta, so they can find the link to her, to her only fools, and then go check that out. So you just put all this money in her pocket. Like, you know, like the smartest thing to do is if you don't want her, if you don't want her to, to, to benefit anymore, stop talking about her. Stop giving her attention because attention is a currency for women. This is the reason why women will go out and they will buy a pair of shoes that cost $3,000 that they only wear one time. And then they think that they'll, in their mind, this is girl math. Girl math basically like, well, this pair of shoes allowed me to go here. And as a result of being able to get into this party and you get the attention and get, you know, get the attention of these people, then, they, you know, it pays for the shoes. Like what? The attention paid for the shoes. You have to understand, this is how, how, how women work. Like this much, this, this, this specific item allowed me to get this amount of attention and this amount of attention essentially was value was, was this valuable. So that so as a result, that justifies me spending that three thousand dollars for this pair of shoes that I've, I'm only going to wear one time. Like girl math is crazy, y'all. Girl math is crazy. I don't know, man. I don't know. It's like the more you understand women, the more you want, the less you want to have relationships. Okay, there's a saying that you can either understand them or you can love them, but you can't do both. And it's like when I see videos like this, I, I kind of cringe. Like, how can you do this? How can you be proud of, of having your little brother there? And like, oh, bro, look at this, man. Look at this. Look at this. I'm going to give you that thousand dollars. All you have to do is, you know, help me to help me, you know, make degenerate con degenerate content. My goodness gracious. And in her mind, she's probably like, I mean, he's like, well, he's, he's what, like 14? He's already watching this stuff anyway. He knows what's going on. We're all getting money. This is, we're, we're one big happy family. Like, this is so sad. This is so sad. It's so, it's despicable. Let's go ahead and watch the video one more time. Mr. Beast made the wrong person famous because this girl started making weird videos with her brother to promote explicit content. How does it feel to have a sister that has an OF? My friends always ask me if it's pink, but I don't really know what they mean by that. Do you, do you know? Jesus Christ. Click the link in my bio. Just, I can't. Chief. I literally don't understand why people are so pressed because he enjoys making these videos with me. It's literally out of the kindness of his own heart. He enjoys it. He has fun. I even get to take him to do some really cool stuff. So I really don't think he's upset about it. Are you? <laughs> no, not really. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Yeah. My gosh. Like, bro, this is, this is sad. Like, dude, it's going to be crazy when you, when you get older and no one wants to be your friend, you know, no one wants to be your friend. No one wants to hang out with you. Companies don't want to hire you because, you know, of what of the things that your sister has done. All right. Because she's now ruined the family name. And you may not think that the family name means very much, but it's like no one you're going to be alienated in society. I'm telling you, like she's she's literally she's literally robbed from her family. She's stolen their name. She has robbed their name, you know. And it's like it's never ending with these people. I find it to, I find it to be a despicable act, but I find it even more despicable when you're using your your brother to sell your lonely fool subscriptions, lonely fan subscriptions. All right, lonely fans and only fools. All right, because only a fool would be on there. Only a fool would be on these platforms. I think that it's absolutely ridiculous. Only fans creators are using children to sell their subscriptions now and it's pathetic it's this it's the it's this it's just it's degeneracy you know squared you know 
I mean, I don't know, guys. It it has to end at some point, but it's only going to get worse. It's only going to get worse because they literally have no self control. They think that this is funny. They think that this is a way, a new way of living. And it's like they're like this. They're, they think they're going to just keep on tapping into the simp economy, and they're unstoppable. But you know, there's there's somebody who can stop them. His name is Jesus. His name is Jesus. All right, and he could stop you. He could stop you because this ain't. This is just not right. I'm sitting here and I'm like just looking at it, and I'm just beyond disgusted with what I'm seeing and what I'm witnessing from these people. I want to hear your thoughts regarding this. You know. Because these people are using now using their brothers and family members, children to sell their subscriptions on on these platforms. I want to hear your thoughts in the comments. So let's talk about it there. Like the video if you like it. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you like the video, share the video. And just remember that all roads lead to MWA and walking away and shares.